Hi, you're at Steve Morris Engines. I'm Steve Morris. This is the engine for Hollis Jones. Uh, we've been doing tune work on it and have uh, gotten her up pretty decent. This is uh, um, 565 cubic inch, I believe. Uh, has a 14 and a half degree uh, Big Chief style cylinder head. Dart, uh, cast iron, um, dart block, wet sump still, uh, methanol clearly, since we're not running any uh, intercooler whatsoever, twin precision 550 pound per hour injectors, twin uh, welding regulators. Uh, coil pack ignition, big stuff, BS3. 136 Pro Charger. And uh, 123 millimeter throttle body, so it has all the 5 inch stuff. And uh, this actually, if you look, it's kind of slick. Has a, this tube here is stainless. And uh, Jimmy. His uh, chassis guy, I can't remember what Jimmy's last name is, sorry, uh, has formed this into a 4 to 5 inch tube. And you can barely, you barely even really notice it. You can kind of see it there, I guess. Did a really pretty fantastic job on that. That's, that's pretty nice. Uh, but, anyways, we're going to uh, go out of the dining room, uh, make a pull, and take a look at numbers. Take a look at some numbers here. And we'll scroll up to, let me shut this fan off. Yeah, 5500, 15.06. And disregard the air fuel, clearly it's on meth and I'm not using uh, our standard air fuel ratio monitor on it. Um, 6,000, we're at 1721. 7,000, skip that number, but somewhere in between 2145 and 2238, so probably around 2200. Uh, 2238, 93. Still accelerating pretty fast right through here. 2754 is 20. 475 and 2537, 2564, 2610, and then uh, actually I need to go into the uh, EFI because it actually sounded like it just started, like right here it hit the actual rev limiter. So it's still climbing up fairly decent. I know that uh, they probably won't really run this motor much over uh, 8,500 8, at the most, but uh, pretty nice, solid, easy, uh, or uh, good 2600. Uh, horsepower, 8,000 RPM. Um, we can look at the uh, replay on the big stuff here. And I'll tell you what it made for boost. And air fuel ratio. A pretty good overall piece. Uh, I would say uh, we'll take a look at that.
uh, rev limiter or where it's hitting uh, some kind of ignition cut or, or some way shape or form and we'll uh, we might pull this again but everything looks really good right through there and it's making good power so I'm pretty happy with with where it's at put that over there I don't need it at all let's see just about done loading up here Let's see if we can get this good on the screen for you or not. It's a little, a little hard because i got to look at it myself. And we're at a uh, pretty constant air fuel ratio. 3.6 to 3.7 yeah 3 3 7 3 6 3 3 6 9 um, pretty low actually on our uh, duty cycle as we're at um, that large uh, twin injectors on there it's pretty normal so everything looks pretty darn good through there uh, 8,000 RPM it's at 40 42 pounds of boost so there's probably some that there that we could lean on this I you know I think it's a little shy on timing still it's um, uh, we could probably you know sneak in a couple degrees there according to the plug and you know you could probably lean it up a little bit although I think it's probably pretty decent right there uh, air fuel correction is not too bad it's uh, you know, five percent. Uh, I probably go in there and just trim that up just a little bit, so it doesn't have quite as much. Uh, down here, lower in the pole, at you know, 5,800, it's seven percent. So what it's saying. Um, boost at 20 pounds, right there at uh, 58, uh, 6,000. It is 21 pounds of boost, and 7,000. It is 30 pounds of boost. So uh, climbing real nice. Uh, in fact, that's actually pretty pretty straight on the money with uh, 10 pounds per thousand RPM. Um, real efficient w uh, when they get up there. Now we don't have that provoluted either, so uh, I think there could be some more there. But you can't even fit the bell into the car, so we're not going to do that. Um, that's my cell phone. But anyways, uh, everything looks real good. Nice piece for Hollis, and uh, hopefully we can get him out in his car. And doing real well. And I'm Steve Morris. Have a great day.